Good morning, everyone. I have an announcement to make. What's the announcement, Shake? I will be going on vacation today. That's all with some and all, but who's gonna host the club park hatters club while you're on vacation? Come outside with me and I'll tell you who. Shake, who the heck is that? He looks like a robot version of you. Well, nice, that's because it is a robot version of me. This is Roshake. Oh, my name is Roshake. Nice to meet you all. Uh, Shake. Why does Robot Shake have a robot voice? You don't sound like that. Because that's my robot friend, they all right. I don't sound like that. Listen, Roger Shake, you're the leader of the Clown Park Hater Slum. Here's our motto. And Roshake, you can count on me. Go enjoy your vacation. And now I can count on you, Robot Shake. Oh my gosh, Mom, Dad, and Tall. Look, Shake is leaving but his robot counterpart is here. This is gonna be even more terrible. I agree, Chloe. We are not letting Robot Shake stay. Absolutely not. We need to get rid of him. We'll get Goodman to deal with Robot Shake. Doesn't that sound like a good idea? That could work. But Goodman is probably on his way for our house payment. So, we'll ask him after we pay him. It's always important to pay our house payment honestly. Where did you get that idea, Tall? Because our landlord, Goodman, is the smartest out of everyone. In Dougie's robots, damn, he even has a robot counting money. No, Tall, that is a good idea. Let's wait inside for Goodman. He usually knocks on our door. Look, there's Goodman. Now, remember our plan, but... We should keep it cool and play it like normal. Don't worry, Chloe. Nothing can spoil our plan. Hello, Goodman. You must be here for our house payment. That is correct, Winifred and Richard. You know me so well, my friends. Okay, we'll be right back. But first, I have a magic trip to show you. Watch. What's this? A note. And it says your house payment days are over. Meaning you don't have to deal with house payments anymore. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is surprising. What made you want to do that? Sigh. I got to be honest with you guys. I love you guys living in the pineapple house. If someone didn't pay their house payment, I would evict them. And if I keep getting your house payment, you'll run out of money. So, I decided to end your house payment days for good. Another question. Did you notice Robot Shake on your way here? Yes, I did. He was about to shoot lasers at me. I know robots because robot shoots lasers from their eyes. We are planning on getting rid of it. Would you like to join us on our plan? You know what? Sure. I'll join you guys on your plan. You guys have paid your house payment. So, it's time that I return a favor for you guys. Perfect. Shake and his friends are always mean to Chloe. So, Robot Shake is gonna be extra mean to Chloe. Art uh, Master Shake, huh? That guy still owes me money on his house. So, where is he? He went on vacation. That's why he made Robot Shake. Are you kidding me? How can Shake not be able to afford a house payment but afford a vacation? This doesn't make any sense. We don't know, but come on inside and Chloe will tell you our plan to get rid of Robot Shake. Okay. I was planning on coming inside to your house anyway. I want to hear your plan. We hope you'll like it. Alright, so, here is our plan. Goodman will spray water at Robot Shake with our hose. Tall will add Robot Shake to the hose with some Reese's Pieces. I, Chloe Park, will turn on the hose for Goodman. And Mom and Dad will distract Frillick, Meatwit, Amy, Charlie, Pim, Angus, Parker, Russell, Knife, Trophy, Bubble Base, and Orange to keep them busy from finding out our plan. Doesn't sound like a foolproof plan, guys. Are you kidding me? Why wouldn't it be a foolproof plan? Robots aren't waterproof. I'm sure that robot shake will be destroyed after I spray it with water. This plan is gonna work. Oh, I'm Dave, Dave, you're right there. This is Dave, this better be quick because you're on my trip. Oh, Beast Pizza is my favorite, I'm so hungry. Hey, Frillick, Meatwood, Amy, Charlie, Pim, Angus, Parker, Russell, Knife, 
trophy, bubble base, and orange. Uh, what do you want? Look at this picture, doesn't that look funny? Of course not. Jiffy is missing his teeth in that picture, unacceptable and gross. Don't you guys wish you could go to the casino? That place is fun. We do wish we could go to the casino, but we can't because that place is expensive and far away. Unfortunately for you, Robot Shake, I will spray you with water. It was bad enough that Shake is rude to Chloe, so I don't need you being rude to Chloe either. And you just spray me with water. I'll call the cops if you don't do. Chloe, can you please turn on the hose? We're destroying Robot Shake once and for all. Aye, aye, Goodman. Goodbye, Robot Shake, you villainous robot. And then there was the time I used a toothbrush to scratch my back, and then... Oh my god, William and Owen, will you stop talking to us? I have a feeling that you are hitting something from us. Excuse me, Wilhelmina is not my name, it's Winifred. And another thing, that was very rude of you to tell me to stop talking. Well, that's your problem, not ours. So, do us a flavor and stop bothering us and get out of our way. Goodbye, Robot Shade. You will die by water since Robot gets destroyed by water. What the heck? Did you hear that? Robot Shade is screaming. Hey, we're not done. Turn around, please. Oh, come on. This is getting ridiculous. Now, we really know you're hiding something from us. We want to know now. Perfect. Occupation on Destroy Robot Shake was a successful mission. Now, we won't have to deal with Robot Shake anymore. Not so fast, young lady. I'm now on a new mission. It's called yelling at Shake for affording a vacation, but not a house payment. For this, I'll do it by myself. So, no need for your help. We did it, guys. We destroyed Robot Shake. Looks like our plan worked, huh? Yeah. Now, it's my turn to have a plan. I'm gonna yell at Master Shake for affording a vacation, but not a house payment. Oh no. Robot Shake is now destroyed. We gotta tell Shake about this. Hold up. Shake is back from his vacation already. I can fly on the airport or let me on the airplane. This is unacceptable. At least I'm home. Shake, thank goodness you're here. Robot Shake has been destroyed. Oh my goodness, he's destroyed. How did it happen? Isn't it obvious? Tool made a trail of Reese's pieces for Robot Shake to follow. Winifred and Richard distracted us from seeing this plan. And Goodman and Chloe destroyed Robot Shake with water from the hose. Are you kidding me, clown? The Winifred, Richard, time not been destroyed, Robot Shake. We are gonna pay for this. There you are, Shake. I need to have a few words with you. You were on the vacation. How can you afford a vacation but not a house payment? Hey, how do you dare yell at Master Shake? It's not very nice. I don't care. Shake me to pay the consequences. Wait. Was it pay the consequences or face the consequences? Ah, uh, Dr. Goodman, I'm pretty sure it's face the consequences. He needs to face the consequences. You guys should also face the consequences for having Robot Shake led you guys. I have a punishment in mind. I'll be right back. Our Shake, Frillick, Meathwood, Amy, Charlie, Pim, Angus, Parker, Russell, Knife, Trophy, Bubble Base, and Orange gonna be okay? I don't know and I don't care about those selfish jerks. Also, where's your hoodie? When Mr. Goodman sprayed Robot Shake with a hose, my hoodie got wet from the hose, so, I'm drying it. Okay, that is a fair reason. We've never seen you without a hoodie before. You've always wore a hoodie all the time. I don't know if you noticed this, but it's not a good idea to wear your hoodie in this temperature. It's getting too hot for a hoodie. Really? What month is it? Are you kidding me? It's June, the time of the year where temperatures will become hot. I'll be fine, don't you worry. Oh my god, you destroyed Robot Shake! Why would you do that, you mean you? Because you afforded a vacation, but not a house payment. That is not the only punishment I have for you and your friends. I have one more punishment for you guys. Get inside now. Get ready for a spanking with a baseball bat, guys. Don't ever plan like that again. Worst ending ever. Alright guys, do you know what we are doing today? 
Isn't it obvious? We are going to execute Chloe Park. She's gonna die. As far as Rocky wants to play, we've had enough about that girl. It's time to go. Wait. How did you know my middle name was Horseplay? You said it in animated insanity to episode breaking news. Come on, Dad. Let's go play some Wii Fit's Lexic. It's time we'll have a victory party. I can't wait to say not to call to get her kill. <laughs> Let's go to the weapon store. Holy moly. Did you guys hear that? They're gonna execute me. I don't wanna die. I'm too young to die. Do you even know what execution means, Chloe? As a matter of fact, I do. Execution means the carrying out of a sentence of death on a condemned person. Oh my goodness. You're right. How did you know about that? Eric Alberg has teached us about execution in school. Unfortunately for Kirby, it wasn't boating school related. You have some knowledge about execution. Let's not change the subject. We cannot have you dying by Shake nor his friends again, for like the third time. How do we stop Shake and his friends from killing me? I cannot die anymore. Don't worry, Chloe. You will not die by Master Shake and his friends. We are going to protect you no matter what. There's nothing you need to worry about it. Here's another idea. If they do successfully kill you, we'll call the doctor to take you to the hospital. But we should also call the cops about that crime. Killing people is a crime of murder. They should be arrested forever. Darn it. Why haven't I thought of that? If I killed someone, I would go to jail. I don't want to go to jail. Enough. Shake and his friends are on their way and I'm even more nervous than before. What are we gonna do? Don't worry, Chloe. You're gonna be fine. I promise. We will always call the doctor or police to that type of murder. Yeah, I suppose you're right. They've deal with those ideas before honestly. Oh my goodness, Shake and his friends are here. What should I do? Don't worry, Chloe. You'll be fine. Well, well, well. Look what we got here. Chloe, prepare to die today. Okay, I'm getting out of here. Hey, Winifred, do you know where Chloe went? Well, I don't know where Chloe went, but I'm not telling you because you're gonna execute her like you always do. I heard you tell me where Chloe is, or I'm gonna knock your tooth out. Okay, fine, but only because I don't want my tooth knocked out. She is in the kitchen. Thank you. Was that so hard? Let's get Chloe right now. Phew, I should be safe here. Shake and his friends better not find me here. Hello. So we have found you know me. Hey, hey, boy, hey! Yes, orange. Spike ball! Ooh, my stomach. That really hurts. Be careful. I have a purple stomach, you know. I'm out of here. Hey, Troy's getting away again. Where did she go this time? There. I should be safe in my room. Because I just locked my bedroom door. What the heck? How did you get in my room? I locked my bedroom door but you came in. In case you haven't noticed, we have a key that looks exactly like yours. As saw this at Cloud Park. Oh, that bullet really hurts. I'm getting out of here and you better not find me wherever I go. Understand? <coughs> Why does Chloe always run away from us when we hurt him? Hey, get back here! Well, execution time. Okay, okay, I got to hide in the bathroom, call the cops with my phone, make sure that they get arrested, and then call Goodman to evict them, yeah, that's good, and then me and my family will live happily ever after. Yeah, except you forgot the part where we kill you for good. How did you get that thwomp in here? He looks creepy looking. His magic is to change the fault size, we wanted him to squish you. Wow, so rude. She just walked away while we were talking. Where did she go this time? Perfect. I'm outside. I sure hope I'm safe outside. Nothing bad happens when you're outside besides the weather. Unfortunately for you, Chloe. You won't be safe out here. We're still gonna bull you 24 sevenths. In fact, running away from us isn't gonna prevent from you from getting killed by us. Who is next? I have an AK Chloe, can I kill a question? Sure, Shake. What's the question you want to ask me? No, ask. Out oh, my head. That really hurts. I don't care, Cloud. Now I'm done. And Ricky has to kill you. And he has worse. Please don't rip me in half. 
I don't wanna die. Well, too bad, long to be firm for him. Just closed admission at Complexionate's party. I cannot believe this. We finally killed Chloe. This is the best Chloe's execution ever. I agree, partner. Now we will have to deal with Chloe and We are finally free at last. Oh my goodness. Chloe got ripped in half. I knew they were up to trouble. That's it. I'm calling the doctor and the cops. Just then. By sheer coincidence. Hey, there. Did someone call the doctor? And the police. Yes, we did. Chloe has been ripped in half. Can you tell us how Chloe got ripped in half? Well, my sister, Chloe, has been ripped in half by Master Sheik and his friends. Are you kidding me? They killed Chloe again? For like the third time. What do you mean third time? The first time Sheik and his friends killed Chloe was with a train. And then the second time Sheik and his friends killed Chloe was with a killer pumpkin from Iggy 35. So, this marks the third time Sheik and his friends killed Chloe. Oh, I see. I'll just take Chloe to the hospital and put a cast on her body. Now, where does Sheik and his friends live? They live next door to us, as in 122 Kong Street. Okay, that was a helpful advice, not to mention very specific address. Thank you, Winifred. I'm gonna go arrest them again. Have a good day, guys. Come on, let's go visit Chloe at the hospital. We should wish her a get well soon. Shay! Someone's at the door! We should go get it! I was actually planning on doing it anyway, you're in. Freeze. Shake and friends. Hands in the air right now. Oh, what's going on? You guys are under arrest for killing Chloe Amy Park for the third time. That is unacceptable. Officer, you got to understand. It was execution day for Chloe. Meaning that we can kill her. It was so successful. Well, successful my buddy. I hate it when you do stuff like that. Get in the car right now. Alright, alright. Fine. We'll get in the car. Well, good. You better. Alright, guys. Fortunately for us, we were able to patch Chloe up. But unfortunately, she won't be able to talk. So, whenever she tries to talk, the subtitles are going to have to appear. I hope you can read them. I'll leave you alone for now. Oh my gosh! Slow! Are you okay? Listen, Cloud, I feel bad about you. I honestly cannot believe they ripped you in half. Why in the Neptune's name would Shake and his friends rip you in half? Everyone loves you. Wait! Execution day! It's a thing! Don't worry, Chloe. Shake and his friends won't bother you at least for a while. They are now in jail for what they did to you. You see, Cho, you've got one quantity Shake will never have. You're the best employee ever. You know what? When I see Shake and his friends again, I'm gonna write them up for ripping you in half. That was a dangerous thing to do. Dad gum, Pooh! No cutting! Are you gonna be Kate? Because you are now bandaged! You might have to hear completely bandaged all over your butt. This is what happened when you got Rick in half. I may have to hire a temporary Frank Hook until you're out of the hospital. And Chloe, fortunately for you, I have a robot version of you. It will do your schoolwork until you're out of the hospital. You can just relax for a few months. And unfortunately, we may have to watch a few football games without you. You're in the hospital already for a few months, I hope. That was soon. I cannot believe our daughter got ripped in half and became bandaged after being ripped in half. This is upsetting. We should put Chloe in a bubble the next time she goes outside. Doesn't that sound like a good idea? No. Of course not. Good question. Because I think it's a stupid idea. Bubbles get popped easily. Remember. Mm -hmm.
Hey, guys. Sorry to interrupt, but time's up. Well, Chloe, we gotta go now. Get well soon. I cannot believe you goose ripped my free cook in half. Do you have any idea what you have done? Yes, but it was execution day for Clark. We finally killed Clark today. Congratulations. Thanks to you. Slow is to be in the hospital for a few months while I find a temporary free cook. Also, I was being sarcastic when I said congratulations. Cramps, you don't understand. We hate Chloe so much. We want to kill her during our execution day. Oh my god! What part of it there's someone you hate wasn't clear? I should have never hired you ghosts in the first place. If you fired me, Anorant, because of the restraining order. I don't care. You will throw an apology when you see her again. Also, until you get out of jail, I put your house for rent. What? Why would you do that? To make sure your house stays safe. Now, goodbye, for now. And don't say thank you, you meanies. I should have ignored her instead of using that harmful prank. Yeah, I'm...